Hey guys, what's up? It's your girl Leah or Breezy coming at you with a whole new video. <laughs> My hair is a little wild. This is how I woke up, not gonna lie. First of all, before I even get into what the video is about, I know you're gonna see this and I know you're gonna be like, what is this? Um, so what had happened was my boyfriend bought a little motorcycle a little little baby one you know and i was riding it and i kind of i don't want to say lost control but something happened and my face just went straight into the handlebars and i guess it went down like this because i have a boo-boo up here i have one up here this one's obviously the worst one and then my nose ring actually came out and it's crazy because i can't even pull this out so that's how you know the force of it and so i'm this happened yesterday but anyways it's okay it's not that much pain so i'm okay but anyways as you see by the title this video is me doing my own nails for the first time so i got my nails done maybe two weeks ago and they were lifting on this hand and so i um just took them off but i'm like you know what let me just let me just see what i can do and try to do this and so that's what i did but i also used this kiss acrylic nail kit and this comes with nail forms a buffer um acrylic liquid primer clear acrylic powder some glue but this glue i like this glue but the one that came in here was defective and then this green thing right here is um to max the smell of the monomer which is cool but i didn't like it it's kind of made it stink worse to me and i like the smell of monomer so i really didn't need it but i just want to try and then in the back, it comes with um, natural and white nail tips, as well as a brush and a little cuticle pusher thing. And it came with a nail file, if I said that already. But yeah, so I'm going to be using this in the video just because I want to try it out. Anyways, without further ado, I'll stop talking and we can get on with the video. hey guys so in today's video i'm going to be doing a voiceover because i really didn't do much talking but as you can see i'm opening up the kiss acrylic nail kit and okay we're just gonna go straight into filing the nail so that's what i'm doing <laughs> and then i'm gonna do the other hand as well or the other finger as well so um the nails that obviously fell off was my ring finger and my index finger so that's why i'm filing those down and right here we're working with the kiss primer which i never use a primer so i guess it's a good thing that i have it today i guess i don't really know then we're gonna glue i cut it out of the video but getting the glue out of that bottle took me like a good 20 minutes i swear it was crazy but now i'm just seeing okay I was just seeing if they were even and I'm just gonna try to blend that fake nail into my real nail you know how it goes now I'm just gonna cut them to get them in the shape that I want which is obviously coffin I fuck with coffin heavy And then I do the same thing with my index finger. You will see in a second how crooked I glued on my index finger. It was um, accidental. It was a mistake. I was thinking maybe I could file it and make it straight, but then I was like, if I do that, I might ruin it. So I just ended up leaving it crooked like that. So it's still on my finger right now as I'm doing this voiceover, looking super crooked. But you know what? Don't pay attention to that. Just pay attention to the work. Anyways. Now we're just pouring the acrylic liquid into our dappin dish, which we finally got one with this kit, which is awesome. And we're going to put some of that masking shit. It's like a green apple thing. It actually made it smell worse. Like It actually gave me more of a headache than Monomer does, and Monomer never gives me a headache. Anyways, we're going to be working with our pink acrylic from the We'll Be Fine um, acrylic nail kit that I got in the first nail videos that I did, because... I didn't feel like opening the clear, the clear acrylic that it, the kit came with and um, I already had clear so I didn't feel like opening it. But yeah, I'm doing the three bead method, the one in the middle, one at the bottom by the cuticle and then the one at the tip of the nail on this finger and then I do the same thing on the other finger but you will see that in I guess a couple seconds. And okay, so... With this one, I I did end up using the model ones 
um, purple thing that I had, purple acrylic powder that I had, because I was thinking something else, but then I messed up by putting clear acrylic on top of it, because I, I don't know what I was thinking when I did that, but the nails now, you'll see in the end, they look good, but they could have been better if I would have held off with that clear until the end, and you'll see why, you'll see what I'm talking about. Okay, so now we're getting the gold flakes. You know, we had to, you know, try to match the other nails at least. So we're going to get those gold flakes and we're going to just start placing them on the nail in, you know, an orderly fashion. And then what I was doing here was I would get some more monomer or acrylic liquid on the brush and then just paint my nail with that so that those gold flakes had something to stick to. And this isn't like two times speed or something because honestly if it was slowed down like this would have been a whole 50 minutes <laughs> Okay, I think we're still on the first finger. I thought we would be on the second one by now. Okay, now we're on to the second finger. The second finger, I didn't show as much work as I did because I felt like it was just, you know, repeating itself. I'm just putting the gold flakes in spots that I wanted it to. But then one of the gold flakes fell in the wrong spot, so then I just had to kind of work from there because I couldn't pick it up afterwards. So I just had to work from there, but it ended up working out, I guess. It, looks, it still looks nice, I think, you know? Just could have been a little bit less. I just wanted something a little bit more simple but it's fine i still like it i think it's cute so it's all good but this one i didn't show too much because the first one was a lot now this is what i was saying where i messed up it's because i already had put the clear acrylic coat on top of this now already so now i'm doing it again because of these gold flakes and that's what i'm saying why i should have waited and held off a little bit with that first clear coat that i did because then it just made this nail a little bit more extra bulky than it needed to be but you know i'm that big so i uh clutched it at the end but yeah now we're just getting into painting the gel coat i did file those nails and buff them out and everything like that but this is the final look i really like the really the crooked nail and then the bulky nail it's cute i just wish it wasn't so bulky but yeah thanks thank you guys for watching this video if you enjoyed it I'm here every Monday, so you can come back and watch some more videos if you want. Anyways, you guys have a good one. I don't know why. It's the customer service of me. Guys, have a good one. See you next week. Bye-bye now.